uterine cancer is actually one that has a pretty easy symptom to spot. So most women with uterine cancer present with bleeding during menopause. So once women go through menopause, which we define as no periods for one year, they shouldn't have any further vaginal bleeding. So anytime you have bleeding after that time, when you're in menopause, that is abnormal. And that should prompt an evaluation by a gynecologist, uh, possibly an ultrasound or a biopsy to see if there's a cancer in the uterus or a precancer. Women who are still having periods, but maybe skip periods. So if you may skip periods for three or six months, that can be a, a risk factor for uterine cancer as well. So skipping periods and then having really heavy bleeding is another concern for women who are still having periods. Also, if your periods change, and if you're older and you start to have periods that are really heavy every month, that could also be a sign that's concerning for endometrial cancer and would be another reason to talk to your gynecologist.